Hi guys, Kelly here, and today I am going to show you what I got for Christmas. Now I know that Christmas is th was three days ago, but and this is a little late, but Merry Christmas, and I hope you guys had a wonderful day, and that you, whether you celebrate Christmas or you don't, I still hope you had a wonderful day no matter what. So... I didn't get any makeup for Christmas, and I know that that's weird because I've kind of turned this into a makeup channel, but I really didn't want this to just be a makeup channel because that's not the only thing I love. I love dolls, and I do still do dolls on this channel, but I also love crafty things. That's actually who I am inside. I'm a crafter. The makeup stuff is literally an extension of the artwork that I do already. Uh, my paintings, my, my, uh, I don't, I, I just, just started, uh, doing, uh, polymer clay, so, I, and I do so, I make Barbie clothes, I make Barbie furniture, and that is part of my creative process that I do, so I, the makeup is just an extension, and it was not my intention to just make this a pure makeup channel, so it was actually supposed to be a toy channel, but I wasn't getting as many views as I would have liked. And so, but whatever. I still want to do makeup on this channel, and I still want to to do stuff like that. But I'm also going to slowly incorporate some also, you know, like craft stuff. And basically what I'm going to show you today is what I got for Christmas, and it's all craft stuff. No makeup, no dolls, no nothing. Not that I didn't want those things, because there are a lot of things I want, but when it really comes down to it, do I really need two, three more palettes? Yes, yes I do. I just can't get my dad to understand, or my boyfriend, nobody understands, but you guys. Anyway, so, um, my gifts were kind of bought last minute, and... I looked to my father and my boyfriend and I said, hey, you guys, uh, I, I don't want you to, to think I'm being an ass, but uh, you guys will be the only ones opening anything because nobody has bought me anything for Christmas. And they were like, oh, crap. So um, they're like, well, we should go and buy you something. Where do you want to go? You know, we only have this, we only have X amount of money. So I said, well, let's go to Joanne's. Actually, I wanted to go to Michael's because I like I happen to like Michael's a little bit more. And Joanne's is more of a fabric story. It's called Joanne's Fat. Joanne, Joanne's Fabrics for a reason. Is it Joanne's Fabric or Joanne Fabrics? I don't know. Um, but some of the stores sell a lot more, uh, a lot other. Um, oh, I can't speak today. Words have left. <laughs> so I decided that we would go to Joann's because we were also needed to go over to Walmart to get some things so uh, I got let me show you one of the first things that was kind of also a peek but it wasn't what I wanted to show you I've already recorded this video so I did uh, get this Sculpey uh, clay roller or clay conditioning machine. You can make them really, really thin. I've already used this, and it's made it's made with stainless steel, and it is it's really nice. I actually really, really like it. You can do all sorts of things with it. So yeah, I did. I have already tried this, like I said, and down below, or down below, when I put it on my, when I put this thing on my desk and I crank the handle, it won't go past my desk, so I have to put the machine on this box, that's why it's still in its box, because, you know, that's, but it is really cool, um, and I've been wanting one of those, been looking for one of those, and I actually found it at Joann's, and it was kind of cheap, I was really excited about it. So then one of the other things that I really like to do is do perler beads. And if you don't know what perler beads are, they're, they're little melty beads. They're about that big. They're that are actually this big. This is a perler bead. And you can do almost anything with it, but they're melty beads. 
So I got a big giant pegboard and a little pattern that goes on the back of it for a macaw. That was exciting. And then I got three different books or pattern books. I got a DC that kind of has uh, quite and chibi looking patterns in them, which I'll be doing. I'm really excited about that. I would really like to do that pattern on the back. Uh, this one? I think this is this Wonder Woman right here is the Wonder Woman because she looks ultra pissy. I think that's the uniform from one of the videos where they had like an alternate timeline or something like that with Justice League. So and then we have a Super Mario Super Mario Brothers 3 and I love this. This is one of my favorite video games back when the Nintendo was still good. And if you're offended by that, I don't care. Cause let's face it, Nintendo after one once Nintendo went down to the Wii part, the Wii the, the Nintendo became crap. And I don't care what anybody says. Uh, and then here is another Justice League, and it has uh, full faces, and my favorite part, I don't know if that's not my favorite part, uh, it has full length like posters in them. So, and then, I'll put those up here, so then I got, uh, these little kits right here and I got a Wonder Woman which I've already done and put together and I will show you here in a minute and I got Batman I love Batman I love me some Batman so um this is what this is what the Wonder Woman looks like she's already done and put together isn't that cool I mean that's like full-on face my face hides behind it and I can still see to the holes. Mm. Okay. So what comes in this kit is you get the beads. Now, the beads, you get extra beads, thankfully, because my ass would have lost them all. I didn't, but I, I would. They don't come separated, so it's literally you open up the top. The bag is not resealable, which irritates me a little bit. And... It's literally, there's no pockets in here or anything. It's literally just an open bag. It's not separated. The beads aren't separated. You literally have to separate them yourself. And that, for a crafter, especially when, something, when you're gonna about to do a project this big, that frustrates me. Um, I do another craft. Uh, it's called Diamond Dots. Or what is this one called? I don't know, but it's, it's, it's like Diamond Dots. And basically, I'm going to put a dot, a little sparkly plastic dot, on each of the dots that are in here. I don't know how well you can see that. Let's make it really close you can. So, and, you know, they have over 23 different colors that are separated, and they come separated. And granted, the bags are, you know, that big by that big. But, and these would probably be bigger. However, it would have made my life just a little bit more easier. I wouldn't have had to spend the time separating them. Um, just like you, you can see right here, the mix down here. That, that's not, it's actually, I don't know, that's weird. It's weird that they show the mix that's going to be in there, but don't actually, it's not like a window or anything, it's weird. Also, I could have done without these, the tweezers that come in there. It comes also with instructions, which I'll show you, and uh, an iron paper. So this is the instructions. It literally is the full size of Wonder Woman, so you can put it behind your pegboard. And it comes with the ironing paper. This ironing paper is magic. Do not think that parchment or wax paper is that, because... My projects have been ruined because I could not get the plastic or the paper off the back of my projects. So I will be doing Batman next. Let me know if you want to see him when he's done. So, I would have much rather the kit had come with maybe a pegboard or it had come with... 
I don't know, anything, maybe little baggies to at least separate the beads in, but the tweezers didn't do, they, they don't help. I, they just don't help, they're crap. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> so I just wanted to give you a little, like, mini review. What is, is this thing in my hair? No, okay. Yeah, it is, there's something in my hair, right? No, there's not. I'm freaking out. No, it's just light. I just took a shower. So, tried a few products that I got out of my Target. And, yeah, my Target uh, 12 Days of Beauty thing. And I will review them when I have tested them all. So, guys, I think that is it for this my Christmas haul uh, I didn't show you so one of the things about the kits that you'll need to know if you buy one of these like I said I got these at Joann's uh, is you are required to have six pegboards I only have five so that's why I said I wish that they would have come at least with at least one pegboard um, but, and my boyfriend actually bought me, like I said, this huge one, but it doesn't fit. I'm hoping maybe Batman will fit on it because I kind of messed up Wonder Woman because I kind of had to do her a square at a time. Although I guess I really didn't have to. I guess I could have found a way not to. But yeah, guys, that is it for this video. I have some extra videos coming out from things that I found while I was at Walmart the other day, and I will see you in my very next video. I love you guys so, so much. Thanks for watching, and thanks for sticking around. And you guys have a good rest of the day. Bye, guys!